Yeah, this is a weird stealth section, which, I mean, it makes sense in terms of the story, but it's like... I don't know. Oh, good. This guy's got the most basic patrol path. Let's see if I can just... He'll never know. Oh, no, I was on Expulso. Anyway, machine gun. I don't think they infinitely spawn down here. So, I think I'm good to go. I didn't need that, but it worked for me. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, I'm going straight. Okay. It's pretty linear, but can still get lost all the time. Oh, that was everyone. Perfect. Hey, buddy. I don't know where they're coming from. How are they coming from behind? That's not how games work. That's how real life works. I'll make my way down. Don't you worry. I'm not even sure if I'm going the right way. Oh! Quibbler! Man, I'm just getting all these by accident. Expulso's really good. And... Basically, the only reason you would ever use, uh... Stupefy over it is because... It, uh... Stupefy is just a single shot. So, like, if you need to snipe for some reason. And, uh, yep. You heard what she said. Get moving. Hey, it's that guy again. Okay, we're stealth in this. I can't believe I have to go all the way around? Because it would just be easier uh, to walk the other way. I don't know why... It, I think it's a circle, at least. Oh, well. Oh, don't lie to me. They wouldn't have Harry in a cell. They'd just murder him out front. This way. Oh, Dementors. I'm glad they leave the, uh, the door to the courtroom open. That's great. Overpower Umbridge? Oh my god, look at that chunk of text. Why is she the only one in this room? Man, talk about judge, jury, and executioner. Hey, buddy. Yeah, that's right. Let's just do a boss fight with Umbridge. Happens. Yep, this is how you do it. She'll, uh... She'll get some guys. She'll teleport a bit. And then you just shoot her. Where is she? There she is. She never really is able to do enough damage on, well, at least normal mode. I've never played it on any other difficulty. She doesn't do enough damage in one sitting to actually, uh, like, knock you out. Even if she is using Expulso, which you stole from her office, so there's something. She learned the spell specifically to fight you right now. But hers appears a lot shorter than yours. So, whatever. Expulso. Ouch. Oh man, there was three this time. Watch out. Oh, four? Man, she's up in security. Ouch. She dead yet? You have to do this a couple times, like a ridiculous amount. Oh, yeah, she's dead. Harry Potter, 
One of the few students at the school who famously has a Patronus? I mean, you should know that from like two years back. Wait, Hermione has to do this? Here, let me do this for you. Not even just a Patronus, a, a corp corporeal Patronus. Okay, where am I going? Now this is where the uh, fight starts, and this is where it gets, you know, redeemable, in a way. Kinda. Sorta. Mix and match spells, no way, just use an Expulso, because all the other ones suck for now. Hey, buddy. There is a slight cooldown that you have to deal with for Expulso, but usually it's okay. That guy freaked out. Oh, ha cool. Works for me. Get that exploding potion. Where'd this guy go? Come on. There we go. Did he drop anything? Nope. Cool, let's go. They're that far away and they missed with their dumb stupefies. Come on. Oh, need cover. Let's just, uh, unfortunately the only spell you can actually do out of cover is do, ah. Uh, Yeah, I was in a bad spot. The only, uh, the only spell you can do out of cover is stupefy, like blind fire like this. And it's relatively accurate for what you'd think it would be. Nope. That's not how you throw grenades. And that's not a grenade, Chuck. Oh, God. There, oh, God. Get in cover. Jesus. And that's why you don't throw uh, grenades from cover, because Harry just drops them immediately and he doesn't actually chuck them. Chest high walls. Okay. Let's keep on moving on. Ah, oh, God. Oh God, Harry, come on. Learn how to throw. Did that work? Yeah, it appears to have worked. And I get a free exploding potion out of the deal. What the hell is going on? Oh God, it's that guy. Excuse me, just running, running and hiding. Where's this guy? Ron and Hermione are relatively useless. Oh, what? Ugh. I can't tell where anything's coming from. Okay. Get in cover. Time to liberally use grenades. Unfortunately, Ron and Hermione are relatively useless. Like... They might as well not even be here. They do a couple pod shots, but for the most part, you do everything on your own. Like, it's not even funny how little they can help. Grenade! Blind fire! Blind fire expulso is actually worth it. Which is one of the reasons you, you kind of don't need that much cover in this game. Oh my god, this fall over. Thank you. I can't believe Ron didn't deal with that guy. So this isn't a great set piece just because there's not a ton of cover. And there's a lot of choke points for you. I mean, that's kind of the point. But it's also one of the first real fights you get in the game. The uh, next level is a lot better in the whole fighting regard, mostly because you don't stealth the first half of the level. Oh my god, Ron, stop walking into him! You're blocking all my shots!
No, not Protego. And a weird thing is, if you're moving while using Expected Patronum, all of a sudden Harry starts walking forward. Is he falling? Oh my god. Thank you. I drank it, didn't I? There we go. Now I'm drinking it. Where are you? Power ups. Oh my god, fall over. I am shooting you. Stealth. Oh, missed him somehow. Oh, did I get the other person? I did! So that wasn't completely useless. And I'll just do this. I think I'm going this way. Am I? I can't tell. Too much blue. Okay. We're in the clear. I mean, there were Dementors coming this way, so, you know, I thought. Good guess, I guess. No, B is this. I'm going the wrong way. Oh, hey. Hey, buddy. Are you dead yet? Cool. Ouch. Oh. Cool. Hit a box. Take that. Nope. Going this way. Hey! <laughs> oh man, I can't just... <laughs> when I fall over, I can't just immediately shoot like I can in uh, MGS4. That's unfortunate. Oh god, what is happening? They're fighting people, but I don't know where they are, so I'm just gonna... Hey! <laughs> Oh god. Oh, oh, there we go. And there you go. Oh my god. I didn't have this much oh. I didn't have this much much trouble with my practice run of this game, so I don't know what's going on right now. I'm I guess I'm just I d I really don't like this level, so that's probably something to do with it. I say probably, I mean definitely something to do with it. Oh man! So far, so good, eh? We're doing Expelliarmus. Expelliarmus is really good if you actually use auto aim. And you'll see why. Hey, it's that guy. Let's try it on him. Nope, that's not how you shoot spells. So you gotta charge it. But once you charge it, it's almost always a one-hit kill if you can actually hit him. Which is really good. Unfortunately, it's only really good if the guy isn't shooting at you. So in single combat, it's not that great. And we actually have to go around to do this. Let's see if uh, invisibility will help me with this section. Oh my god, is it helping with this section? Why have I never thought of this before? And it may be saying that the flus are closing and stuff like that, but it's lying. You have basically all the time in the world. And I think you just have to wait for Ron and Hermione to make it to you. Maybe. Nope. Well, I avoided a really annoying fight. It's really annoying because there's no cover at all, and it's just a long hallway with a million respawning dudes. So I guess. Sneaking works. See ya.